communist regime lasted for almost 50 years here in Romania and there was basically no freedom and because Romania had huge international debts the way that our dictator found a solution was to just cut costs which meant basic needs for the Romanian people we notice from younger and younger ages that these kids ask those big questions you know about death about wars about suffering we need to offer our kids a different experience and a different future. We wanted to develop a school that focuses on multiple intelligences, multiple competencies. We started as a small kindergarten with 30 children. We have currently around almost 600 students, 140 teachers and staff. We have around 60% that are local families from Romania, and then about 40% of our families are from all over the world. We started about six years ago and we were really passionate about mindfulness and social emotional learning and we used various curricula up to a point where we realized what worked for us and what didn't. We chose it because it had a lot of new features that we kind of realized we needed, like more trauma-informed tools, for example, more ethics, more compassion. It's really wonderful to provide an operating system for our children so that they're excelling academically, but they're also learning how to be resilient, how to suffer less, how to be happy, essentially. One of the main things that I really appreciate about the C learning curriculum is the fact that it's a secular curriculum. It's inclusive of all stakeholders, but it's also a curriculum that's really focused on personal development and a personal exploration. What we are trying to do is to model and create context for them where these values that we talk to them about, you know, compassion, kindness, empathy, can be felt through real experiences, whether they happen in the classroom or at times outside of the classroom. Right now, all 550 children uh, receive uh, C learning starting with primary and as a standalone class in advisory, as teaching moments, as after school. We've implemented it all the way to most of the staff and it's only going to grow. We want the parents to be involved in this, so we get a sense that C-learning is for everybody. Verita is a very groundbreaking thing in, in Romania and I know for many parents it's a leap of faith because the traditional national curriculum is completely different. It's performance oriented. Um, there's no much uh, teamwork. I have been surprised that my kids know so much about emotions and they have learned to deal with them and learn that there's no bad emotions just to identify them. I have been surprised when I have been maybe cranky driving after picking them up and my son told me, hmm, you're a bit cranky. Maybe you need to speak with a friend, or maybe you need an apple. <laughs> One of the first things that happened when, once I started uh, with C was that I realized I could not do this if I didn't try it on myself. So all of the resourcing, the grounding, the reflective practices, at first I, I encountered resistance as well. We start to embody it. We live it. It's in the corridors rather than in the classroom. And I think the support um, from that comes through, you know, those little interactions. See learning, it's more than kindness. It's a set of uh, principle that will help you first understand yourself and then you can understand the others to the lens of see learning. The online platform, that's a good tool because I can study it in my own way when I have my own time and I can go through scaffolding and I can see it better and then I can practice it, I can pause it and then have a reflection and then go and do that again. I think that sea learning teaches children those life skills, those very useful life skills that they will rely on when they're children and adolescents and grown-ups. And you can really see the difference. I see them right now a lot more open, a lot more willing to share and super empowered, especially when it comes to, let's say, classroom agreements, because they are the ones choosing, they have a say in what we decide together as a group. 
we all as parents want our kids to be well and to be balanced and happy kids. But that missing piece was the ethical part of how are we going to share this with the world. We've taken the initiative of creating a foundation and helping and supporting teachers from rural areas all over Romania. We said we have to translate this program into Romania. Our experience was, we considered it meaningful and relevant. We've actually run a short summer school and through that some teachers from state schools found out more about sea learning and they want us to go and uh, do some trainings. We are going to have the first getting started with sea learning to a group of 60 educators. We are now uh, building momentum and building the capacity and the resources to go out uh, wherever we are uh, asked because we are human beings at the end of the day, we just want to make this bridge of we are learning together so that we grow up in these communities where we value compassion and we value kindness because we understand that long term there's no survival.